Assalamu alaikum friends welcome to simple homemade projects to make this smart soldering dispenser we need a 5 volts dc gear motor a dc jack relay module infrared proximity sensor small bearing this bearing can be obtained from an old pc cooling fan a steel shaft with a diameter equal to the inner diameter of the bearing and a piece of metal tube and PVC foam board sheet first of all cut the PVC foam board in order to make housing for the dispenser cut two more round pieces and fix them together using super glue Drill a hole in the center, insert a bolt in it and tighten up the nut. Now insert it in a Dremel or a drill machine and sand it to make it perfectly round. Now make a depression in it according to the thickness of the bearing. Now fix it on the motor shaft. Now cut a rubber strip from an old tire tube and fix it on the bearing using super glue. Fix the motor on the base plate using some hot glue. Now cut two PVC board strips and drill holes in them. Insert bearing on the shaft and pass it through the holes of the strips and glue the strips on the base plate as shown. Now cut two bigger strips, again drill the holes and insert the solder coil and secure it using a nut and a bolt. Now take a small piece of metal tube and fix it on top of the PVC board piece. And secure it on the base plate using some glue. Now using the super glue fix the front and the side panel. Now drill a hole in the front panel in line with the bearing. Insert a small piece of metal tube and secure it with super glue. And now it's time to install the electronics. Make all the connections as shown in this circuit diagram. Don't forget to attach the motor wires in the normally open terminals of the relay module. Insert the solder wire through the metal pipe, then the bearing, and then again through the metal pipe on the front panel. Now fix the remaining side panel. Glue two small pieces diagonally inside near the top with holes in them to secure the top plate so that it can be opened later to replace the solder coil. It's time to power it up using a 5 volts DC power source. And here you go. You can set the range of the proximity sensor according to your thing by adjusting the potential meter on it. That's 
all from my side hope you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share and subscribe take care allah hafiz